All right, so this is a suggestion via Patreon. The name of the video is uh, 23 Actors Who Can Actually Sing. We're here. Let's get it. Um, a lot of you guys have actually been messaging me on, on Twitter, uh, Instagram, uh, email, asking me one very specific question. Where has your music reactions gone? Guys, we made a couple, we, well, well, we made a channel uh, two weeks ago, three weeks ago, somewhere in there, um, called Mr. L. Boyd Music, where I still almost exclusively do, well, no, not almost. I just exclusively do music there, right? Um, so if that's your thing, Music reaction channel, Mr. L. Boyd music. All right. Um, but all right, let's get it. Let's it uh, this is uh, Jeremy Renner. Miami Beach or Hollywood. I'm taking a greyhound on the Hudson River line. <laughs> I'm in a New York state of mind. Bro, he can really sing like for real. Like, this isn't like, uh, like, oh, I can sing a little bit like in a car or in a shower. Nah, vocally, tonally, he's great. This is uh, Jamie Foxx. What's funny is about Jamie Foxx is that I think everyone who knows Jamie Foxx should know that he started out as a singer. Um, actor, singer, comedian type of thing. Multiple albums, billboard charting. He's a singer, bro. He's a singer before he's an, he's an actor. Oh! So this is not a this is not a surprising one. Kiss, just didn't know a downpour like this. There's a there's a flash forward warning. Right. Uh, Zoe Des Chanel. I have no idea who this is. But I thought I'd ask you just the same. No, she looks familiar, guys. Like, like very indie, it kind of feels like uh, um, maybe like Nina Simone's era of music, like the, not saying stylistically, but the era of music that was super popular around that time. She sounds like she just uh, teleported from a different era. Who's gonna be the one who holds you? Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Who's gonna be the one who holds you tight? Well, it's exactly... 12 o'clock at night. Right. Welcoming in the New Year's. New Year's Eve. Solid vibrato. Definitely feels, again, from like the same era. So maybe they were just trying to emulate something that they've uh, maybe heard that, that they liked from like uh, like the big band era of music. That's. They, just, they both just feel like crooners. <laughs> Kate Hudson. I'll never set foot in that rat hole again. Robert Downey Jr., Iron Man. But I'll drive to your place. Really, Robert Downey Jr. I'm be honest, that's surprising. That's probably the most of, as of right now, that's the person I am most surprised by. This next person here is named Amanda Seafried. Tom Cruise. A little time to think things over. I want to see who love is. She don't tell me. Okay. From what I've heard, small amounts, I'm impressed. Me. By Tom Cruise. How uh, this is our Anne Hathaway. I ought to be. She likes me just as I am. It feels very theatrical, like super theatrical. Like she spent a lot of time in like drama class. Uh, I can definitely see her on Broadway. 
with this uh, overall uh, style. So when I get blue, she's the one I go to, for her heart is as big as a head. You hitting notes like that while doing a split? Yesterday I was Hugh Jackman. I think he's um uh, he was in a he was in a very large play that I have been attempting to see for a really long time, but I have not. Um Today you So I, I kind of expected him to be able to sing because I think he does like Broadway. Oh, I'm Emily Blunt. No one leaves for good. You are not alone. Another super theatrical Broadway sounding. I graduated from drama school type of vocal, guys. Feels good. No one is alone. Clean breath control is solid. Great vibrato. Uh, James McC. McAvoy. Okay, I definitely know who this guy is. I uh, never knew his name. I love it. So far right now, he's my favorite. Uh, Kira Knightley. Spelt like uh, North... Wait. Uh, is he she from Ireland? Don't have to be so sweet. Maybe. I know who you're going to meet. Don't say that I don't. Oh, no. Uh, Robert Pattinson. How long, how long must you say? I will say for that mistake, but you no offense, but just super pitchy. When there was nothing and I couldn't take, it's all on you, dog. Afterwards, we drop it. Nicole Kidman. Nicole Kidman. To a quiet little place and have a drink or two. This is a uh, like vocal coach singing. And then I go. So I'm not gonna really count this, guys. Well, not saying that everyone else wasn't, you know, coached by vocals, but you can always tell when like a like an actor was very specifically coached for a part, a song, right? Um, so that's a little different, guys. It's kind of like uh, a lot of the actors and actresses uh, from the play Rent, guys. It's like that. A lot of those singers were just coached specifically to sing that one song, which you take them outside of that very specific element, they fall apart. This is Oscar Isaac. Nothing but Star Wars. Give me those Star Wars. Any old day. This is uh, Kristen Bell. This is that same. A lot of the actors here, well, obviously, they probably, obviously, guys, they, they did drama school, guys. This is not, you know, but um, a lot of them just sound like they, they've they done something like that and they, they focus mainly on, um, like, bro. Oh, This is a Scarlett Johansson. When you should have been guessing. Yeah. yeah. And now someone else is getting all your best. That's right. Okay, I got this. These boots were made for walking. That's just what they'll do. With one of these. I will say this song is not very well suited to show off your vocal ability. 
The song is great. Love Nancy Sinatra. Um, I think that's Nancy Sinatra. These boots are made, these boots are made for walking. Um, but I just don't think that this is a very good like like platform to um, sing over if you're trying to show people. But I don't think she is. Not in this video. I think we're we're looking at this very specific piece of footage like she's trying to show it. But in all actuality, this is like some random B-roll or or behind the scenes whatever project she's working on. So I gotta walk all we have uh, Anna Kendrick and James Corden. Heart. I can't even if I try. James Corden? <laughs> if I get restless. Baby, you're not that kind. Is this real? This can't be real, bro. All right, guys, I'm definitely most surprised about the James uh, McAvoy. That was that's the one that I would say I would like to hear some like an album from you. James Corden is absolutely surprising. I never would have thought, guys. All right. Um, but listen, tell me in the comments uh, who you thought the best one was, though. And who do you think is just kind of like skating by? A couple of them are just skating by, guys. All right. Uh, listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day and enjoy your day thoroughly.